Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Manchester United Career Mode, Season 2, Episode 3. Last time out, um, obviously there we beat Brighton, but I'll say this. We have a long run ahead, and this says nothing. Everton, Liverpool, Man City, Man United. We are the top four, but... Big but Leicester is still two games played at six points, so they could join us in the title fight. Am I confident that we can get past these lot? Yeah, yeah, I am. I'm very confident. And the first game of the episode will be against a North London club by the name of. When it gets there. So I've got some people logged out. Yeah. Um, obviously, the uh, fan film is coming along nicely. I've started writing the script and it's looking good so far. Um, I barely wrote it, but um, how I'm doing it right now is that I have currently just played the games uh, I've not recorded the games or anything but I've played them through a couple of times and I have took some of the inspiration from that because obviously it's about that game so I have to kind of do that but yeah it's coming along so far very nicely as we are going to be facing off against Chelsea and we have the deadline for the submission for the squads. So, Dominic Lawrence, West Brom, I'm going to have a one year loan. That's how you're going to get out of it. And hopefully, that should be that. The bread and butter. Uh, we need to have a look at the national squad right now. Line it up how we want to. Kane is not looking well. Uh, yikes. Where's. Oh, there's Mount. Uh, we'll play Grealish on the centre half. And we'll play Rashford. We'll play Shaw as well. Trippier. Set up right. We'll bring on Trent. Fuck it. Uh, that's the English squad for the upcoming World Cup qualifier matches. Anyways, so hopefully Kane, hopefully everyone, to be honest, is fit for the Chelsea game. Because it's getting really, really tight right now in the Premier League season. And as you see, Chelsea, sorry, Leicester City, did win the last game. So it is a five way title fight. But before we continue, make sure the squad's fit. Oh, some players aren't fully fit. Kane's on 86, 89, 92. We can't really take Shaw off because the big problem Milan Skrilla is injured until March 2022 and that's a big fucking problem so do I want to start green with this game I don't think I want. I don't think I'm gonna start him. I think I'm gonna stick with my guns. It is a very big, monumental game. Man United and Chelsea have a lot of history. And Thanks, guys. ow. Anyways, press conference. Let's have a chat and see what's happening. Uh huh. Very happy squad morale. That's all we care about. 
But let's get right into the game. Let's have a look at the Chelsea side. Barely changed. Moreno is the other one. Oh, Torres. I'm, I don't know which Torres that is, but... Oh, they've also got Kepper in there. I thought they would have used Mendy. Um, so Pulisic, Ziyech on the sides. They're not playing Mason Mount, which is very interesting. But let's get into the game. My United versus Chelsea. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. As you see, hurricane at background, but all eyes on Jadon Sancho today. As he's just warming up. And as you see there, Hakim Ziyech as well. I just focus on the right midfielder today and say it will be crucial. But here we are at the theatre of dreams as it's going to be Manchester United at home welcoming not nicely Chelsea as Thiago Silva and Bruno Fernandes lead out both sides into this legendary rivalry you see there by United and Chelsea are split by two positions but Blackburn Rovers with the Prem. What? I didn't pay attention to the other players, but here we go. Harry Kane, three goals in three matches. Two against Wolves, one against, one against Brighton. Here we go. Teams just waiting patiently as they start to shake hands. We'll see how this goes, but it's going to be a very, very big game today. So I think we should get right into it. It's my United versus Chelsea, it's Manchester United. Kick it off at Old Trafford. Trippier didn't get the ball high enough, but inception by the defence of Sancho to Marcel Sabitzer to Tielemans, Theo Fernandez, Rashford going down the flanks here, and Reese James gets it out for a throw in. Oh, 50 career wins. And we've only done one season of this, so I'm flattered. Rashford throws it back to Ruben Diash, who gets it to Luke Shaw. Kieran Trippier now. Over to Bruno Fernandes. Gets Harry Kane. Kane sees the opening. Harry Kane can get it through. Kante with the block. Kane again and it's Kane. Harry Kane gets it past Kepper. Kante tries to block it. He deflects off Kante and Kane with the volley into the bottom corner. Let's have a look at that again. Bounces off. Kane brings it down. Goes right at Kepa's hand. But it deflects off into the bottom corner. That is very unfortunate. For the Chelsea defence. That is Manchester United 1. Chelsea 0. It looks like it's Pau Torres. Okay. Pau versus the Rhys James. Over to... Thiago Silva to Christian Pulisic. Oh, gets it past. Oh, this could be trouble here. Hakim Ziyech on the wing and Theo Hernandez deflects it out for a throw in. Oh, Havertz back to Ziyech. Whipped in, but Luke Shaw heads it out. Harry Kane brings it down to Bruno Fernandes. Fernandes sees the run by Rashford, but Pau Torres gets the ball down. Back to Gola Kanta. Christian Pulisic. And Chilwell now. Whips it in again and Havertz! Havertz nearly got a goal against the team Manchester United. Just too wide. Oh, Bruno Fernandes to Tielemans. 
Seems to run by Rashford. Rashford did a lot of play rare here. In the box, Rashford gets past one man. Rashford gets past another. Rashford, what's he going to do here? And it's brought down to Kepa. And Kepa hits it out and he goes straight to the feet of Marcus Rashford. Yuri Tielemans to Bruno Fernandes to Sancho. Oh, and that's a poor one by Sancho. Thiago Silva on the ball. Advantage played by the referee. Oh, Thiago Silva get, tried to get off to Christian Pulisic. But, Kieran Trippier gets it down to Marcel Sabitzer. Bruno Fernandes. Kane. Oh, Sabitzer couldn't get the ball and it was just too heavy of a pass. Elmans to Kane, Bruno Fernandes sees Sancho. Does Sancho get past his two markers? Oh, Sancho sees Marcel Sabitzer. Can you see Kane? Harry Kane! Brilliant display of Man United's incredible short passing that has brought down the likes of Manchester City and Liverpool. And as we see there, Sabitzer with the assist to Harry Kane. And this time, Kane did not need a glove to put it in the back of the net. Manchester United 2, Chelsea 0. Igola Kante now gets it to Ben Chilwa. Oh, to Kai Havertz. Who gets it to Hakim Ziyech. And it's out for a Chelsea throw in. Reese James on the ball now, gets it to Paul Torres. Oh, that's a beautiful ball, but it is out for a goal kick. Dean Henderson gets it to Shaw. Back to Henderson. Back to Luke Shaw. Gets it to Kieran Trippier. Here, Trippier sees Bruno Fernandes in the centre all alone. Look at all this space Bruno Fernandes has to find and seek out the big pass that will get the attack going. It's Kane! Oh, that was a beautiful ball by Rashford, but Kane just did not want it enough as Paul Torres just gets his hands on the ball. Kieran Trippier now to Sancho. All the space Sancho has is running out, but he's got more space. Rashford. Not Rashford, Sancho's going to keep going through the gap. Jadon Sancho with a beautiful run and Sancho! Oh, and that is headed out by Thiago Silva. Hakim Ziyech now gets over to Ben Chilwell. It's out for a Manchester United throw in. Throws it to Sabitzer. Back to Kieran Trippier. Bruno Fernandes. Gets it to Theo Hernandez. To Rashford. To Kane to Bruno Fernandes who can go for it and Sancho that was just brilliant defended by Ben Chilwell and the referee is called for half time we're 2-0 up but I feel like we should be more and let's just say you're know, drawing with Man City okay I'm going to make some subs. Let's go with Marcel Sabitzer. Off for Graven Birch. And we're going to bring on Tahit Chong for Marcus Rashford. See how Chong does in a big game environment like this. Paul Torres to Kai Havertz. Who chips it over to Pulisic and it's out for a Man United throw in. Sancho. Throws to Kira Trippier who gets it back to Sancho. Sancho's in a bit of air. Can he turn his mind? He does. Ben Chilwell's been left in the dust by Jadon Sancho. 
brilliant run by the Englishman who gets it in and it's out as Aspilicueta gets it out. So day at the office indeed for Christian Pulisic. But it's out for a Manchester United corner kick. Who's going to, who's going to get the noggin on it? Kane! Somehow fell in the box as Christian Pulisic now gets it to Paul Torres. Therese James to Kai Havertz now on the ball. Sees a beautiful ball to Ben Chilwell. Chilwell on the ball. Whips it in and it's just beautiful there by Dean Henson. Just knocks it out for a throw in. As Kai Havertz now coming off. As Kovacic is coming on the field for Kai Havertz. And Theo Hernandez deflects out for a corner. What's going to happen here now? Everyone's marking. And Chong gets his big dog in on it. Ruben Dias going for a run on Aspilicueta. And Ruben Dias heads it. But it's out for the Chelsea throw in. Matteo Kovacic sees a little gap there. Reese James. Oh, Luke Shaw heads it. Bruno Fernandes on the ball. Sees Harry Kane. Who sees Jadon Sancho. Sancho's on a run. Thiago Silva can't stop him now. Jadon Sancho and... Sancho gets it out wide. That was a shame. Big, big shame for Jadon Sancho. Just too much of a tight angle there. Bruno Fernandes was near the back post, but he could not get to it in time. And Chilwell heads it down to Silva to Kante. And tries to get it over to Ben Chilwell, but... Oh, no, it's Pulisic there. And Trippier did not get the bounce of the ball right. Oh, Jorginho's gone to RB Leipzig. Surprised. Oh, and Sancho just jumps over Kante in time. Oh, here we go. Graver Birch to Sancho. Sancho. Gonna get it past one. Jaden Sancho's in. Just having a bit of problems getting it into the box here. As he whips it in and Kepper gets it out. But Graven Birch gets the ball down. Telemans gets it to Graven Birch. He gets Kieran Trippier to Kane. To Bruno Fernandes, back to Graven Birch. Ryan Graven Birch is off side for the Dutchman. A pass a bit too late there. Just offside. That is a real shame. Aspilaqueta gets over to Ben Chilwell. To Thiago Silva. And Kante now. Back to Thiago Silva, back to Ingola Kante. To Ben Chilwell, Bruno Fernandes with the interception. Kane sees Fernandes run. Bruno Fernandes is in. Bruno Fernandes going to get it over the keeper and it's out. Bruno Fernandes had a brilliant run but just chips it over the goal post. And we're going to make our final change for the game. As Mason Greenwood will be coming on for Harry Kane. We do need some pace up front now in the last 20 minutes. And that's what we need. So one like Great, um, Greenwood. And because the defenders are going to be tired, it will really benefit if they have someone like Greenwood running at the attack. Oh, Gerard Moreno. Gets it to Angola Kante and Shaw. Intercepts the ball. Bruno Fernandes gets it to Greenwood. Gets it to Graven Birch. To Sancho. To Bruno Fernandes. To Greenwood who sees the opportunity. Makes a Greenwood. And he chips it over. I didn't, I didn't even mean to chip it. I was holding B but I forgot. Fuck's sake. Anyways it is chipped over. It's a, man, it's a Chelsea goal kick. Paul Torres. Kovacic to Ziyech. Therese James. Oh. 
Ziyech on the run. Oh, Ruben Diaz gets the ball to Yuri Tielemans, who gets it to Graven Birch. Up to Jaden Sancho, to Greenwood, back to Sancho, to Bruno Fernandes, to Mason Greenwood. Can he get to it? Oh, Thiago Silva just gets it. But that's what we need. We need that pace that Sancho possessed. What the? Chong cannot finesse a shot to save his life. Kepa gets the ball to Thiago Silva. Paul Torres. Back it to Ziek. Ziek sees the ball over to Reese James. Not in the box yet, but Shaw keeps it out of good, out of the way, as it's put down, and it is a throwing for Chelsea. Get to back it to Reese James. Reese James wants to chip it in, but Shaw gets it back. To Tillman who gets it to Fernandes. Oh, Chilwell gets it out for a Manchester United throw in. Straight to Trippier, to Raven Birch, and it's deflected off to Thiago Silva. Otavio now. Thiago Silva now gets it to Chilwell. Chilwell could be on a run, but Trippier with the interception gets it to Raven Birch, to Sancho, back to Fernandes, to Raven Birch. Who sees the run back from Fernandes. Who sees right, um, Mason Greenwood. Greenwood with the finesse and it's in. What my United needed in the last crucial minutes. A pacey striker who could shoot on any foot. And that's where Mason Greenwood delivers. And that is Greenwood's third goal of the season. The way Rooney objective is being completed. Hits off the post and in. Beautiful. Mason Greenwood on his third goal in the Premier League. And it's Manchester United 3, Chelsea 0. With barely any time left. We have about a minute, a minute and a half. We have 45 seconds. Kovacic looks like to try to go for one last attack, but that will be the game. Manchester United topple Stamford Bridge today as they defeat Thomas Tuchel's Chelsea side today. Harry Kane with two goals today. Brilliant. And Mason Greenwood grabs the other, which proves we have two very competent strikers in our team. And it ends as Manchester United 3, Chelsea 0. So that was the game. Let's switch back to my United manager, not England. There we go. But about a loan agreement about Lawrence, they've accepted one year loan. And he will be going to play for West Brom in the Championship. Unless I've missed something. Oh, so let's have a case top walls going on there. Okay, so we are approaching deadline day, which is actually right now. So. Let's have a look. I think the Champions League have been drawn. Um, let's have a look. Here we go, the draw. Who have we been handed? The Champions League. Milan, Moscow and Midland. And yep, yeah, Wolves are in a group with Barcelona, but that is our group. Moscow, Milan and Midland. Pretty straightforward as it says right here. First game will be against AC Milan September 14th, so we'll be meeting up with Zlatan Ibrahimovic then, it seems like. But here we go, transfer deadline day. Oh yeah, Mason Mount is at um, Inter, so. They've talked to him, he's a good strategic 
I've got a friend of Marlon, Suku, and if you're not sure, yep, yep. Yep, oh. They have really revamped their team. They've bought no one, but they've sold 300 million worth. Whilst we have done some business. Anyways. Feyenoord want Chong with an option to buy. No. I'm afraid not, my friend. There'll be no option to buy. There'll only be option for none. That's all you'll get. Uh. Let's see if the money goes up, shall we? Oh, it's gone up by 82 million. We've got a, uh, yeah, bit more dark, nice. Goes up by 51 million, okay. Alright. Bruno Fernandes. Offer. No. Yeah. I. Let's have a look, shall we? Negotiate. Come on, Maurizio. You know you don't want. You know I don't want that. Propose another exchange player. <laughs> Imagine. Well, let's go for Mbappe, see what happens. Uh, we'll reject it. I just want to see what would happen if I actually, uh, you know, offered Mbappe instead. Oh, yeah. Okay. Anyway, seven hours after the transfer window, will we get any more big offers? That Bruno Fernandes one was big, but it weren't a lot of money, and we need money, not a, C uh, not a CDM. Oh, Bologna accepted an offer for wherever his face was. But here we go. This will be the two people going out on loan, Palestri and Chong. Oh, for the comeback, they will be Legend. Wait for it. Wait for it. Derry. Yeah. Whew. Also, I've got another transfer offer. Two hours left, and. They're offering us Jordi Alba and 61 million. Let's have a look at what other players we can potentially buy. If you know what I mean with my chicken shit. Alright. Propose exchange player. The fuck is that defence? Strikers. Griezmann or Lacazette. Yep, Salt and Cavani. Messi, 72 million. Fucking hell. Frankie Dio? No. Paul Pop was there. Salt into that. Fullbacks. Goalkeepers. To Stegen. Right. How about this? There we go. Of course you'll say no. Of course he would. Anyways. We've only bought four people, but it's all a lot. We've got another offer for Greenwood. Why is it with these swap deals, man? Fucking hell. You're, you're definitely not getting Mason Greenwood, mate. Greenwood is going to be a long-term prospect at this club, unless the Blazers say fuck off. Because, you know, it's the Blazers. Oh, shit! Okay! 
We've got an offer to manage PSG. Oh shit. That's interesting. I think I can make this decision for myself. There's a reason it's called the Man United career, but it's not because I was hoping to manage another club. But, here we go. We're going to face off against Russia. We will not be playing these international friendly games, but we know we can win. Anyways. I want to kind of get a step ahead on my own competition. Let's play Calvert Louis. Let's play Sterling. Uh, we're good. Do you cheers? I go to your bottle and throw. Can you tell you me or not? Can you tell you me or not? Anyways, I think we should just skip ahead of these games and go straight to Crystal Palace. Where we will end the episode, I'm afraid, ladies and gentlemen, so... Next episode, we'll have our first Champions League game. Oh, it looks like they swapped up around the meeting. Okay. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, let me just read these messages first off. Scout, scout, scout. Uh... Sancho Trust What? They want Jaden Sat Mitch, please. No way you're ever getting Jaden Sancho is if you lick my ass for it. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all take care and Peace!